Hey, what's up, my little D-baggers? It's your boy, Chad Phillips here from You Know The Program, Bro Knows Best. I love you, mommy. I love you, love you, love you, mommy. I've been getting mad feedback lately about the quality of my dick pics. And I'm here to tell you, you don't need a pretty good dick to take a pretty good dick pic. What you do need, however, my friend, is some knowledge, and I'm going to drop it for you. You are now about to witness the strength of street knowledge. All right, before I get all the hate in the comment section, I want to let y'all know that I know equipment can be expensive. All my looks can be easily achieved with proper composition and a simple smartphone. Now, let's take a look at my package. So, the ring light brings a really dramatic element into your pics. It highlights the head of your subject while the light falls off in the background, causing an overall badass look. Next, the DSLR. You don't need anything that crazy, just the basic Canon Rebel, pretty standard stuff, but very effective. And finally, the telephoto lens. The biggest misconception in the dick pic community is to go wide, but this is straight up bogus information. It takes your subject and totally distorts it. It doesn't allow your audience to see what you really want to show them. What you really need is a longer lens. Unfortunately, to get the best results, you need two people to achieve this. So, get one of your best boys to come over and feed him a couple beers and I'm sure he'll be down for whatever. Once you guys are nice and toasted, wait till you're at your hardest and lay back. Remember to tell him to get sharp focus. This trick really crushes the background and totally isolates the penis. Alright, now that we spent all the time taking the perfect picture, you want to make sure the final product is really dynamic. So what you want to do, take that bad boy, pop it into Photoshop, and just start playing around with it. Oh yeah. And boom, there you have a little D-bag, it's the perfect dick pic. Now, when you're posting yours online, don't forget to tag me in it, because I want to take a look at all your hard work. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the page. And join us next week when we discuss the importance of leg day. Peace. The pull-up bar. You're going to want to make sure that you get one that is portable. Because if you don't do this, you're going to not be able to bring it to your boy's house when you have sleepovers, and they're not going to know. Now that you see me like this, I don't know if I can let you go. Talking crazy, Bobby. What are you? What are you?